Good afternoon, I'm Chris Wood, editor and publisher with Biz West, and we are here at the Confluence Water Conference at the Embassy Suites in Boulder on August 1st. And with me is Casey Davenhill, Executive Director of the Colorado Watershed Assembly. And Casey, thanks for joining us today. Oh, it's my pleasure. So, uh, uh, Casey, maybe uh, talk to me first about the imbalance of water use and availability here in Colorado and how we should really work to address that. Well, um, Chris, thank you for that question. Um, it is interesting to me that we have 90% of the state's population on the eastern side of our state. We get about 20% of the natural precipitation. 80% um, of that water falls on the West Slope. And um, over the years, the West Slope has generously shared that water with the East Slope, um, allowing us to become a leader in agricultural production as well as economic an economic driver for the state. We have um, the top 10 agricultural counties in the state of Colorado um, on the East Slope, and um, a lot of that is from the benefits we've derived from um, Trans Mountain diversions from water um, that uh, that is here naturally, but is supplemented by, by water from the West Slope. So the cooperation between both sides of our state, the East and West Slope, is essential um, so that we can be a unified, a unified voice. We, we um, protect our interests, um, especially in light of the fact that there are other folks who rely on the water that comes from this headwater state that comes from Colorado.